morning, y'all. I just wanted to come on here for a second. Um, I have some new people on Monroe, and there's some new people I have invited. I just want to explain what it is. Um, I used to work for the paper, and I guess that's kind of just in my nature. I never really stopped doing it. I go out. I cover all the events in town, take pictures of everything. I just love doing it. I don't know how to not do it. Um, I was trained very well. But... I started this page for all things Monroe, all the good stuff about Monroe that I've always loved putting out there. I do freelance. I am the community archivist for the library, which means we interview people. We put their stories. They will be saved at the library. Anybody can go and look at them through history and learn about their history. And I do volunteer, too, because I work about 10 hours a week, and it's a lot more than that. I just love it. I love the county. I grew up in the city, didn't get to do a little, a lot of little small town things. And I always thought it was so neat to read the paper. And when I got down here, I just made sure I went to all that stuff. I took my kids to all that stuff. A lot of people want to say there's nothing to do here and there's so much to do here. And if you keep up with the page, you will see that it is packed full. I'm always somewhere. I'm always doing something. Scroll, scroll, scroll. There's so much on there. I put any events that are going to happen before they happen, that they're coming up. I used to make a Terry's list. That was a weekly thing of what was going on. Because everybody said there was nothing to do and I wanted to put that stuff out here. And so much of it is free. I currently have a list for the next few months because there's so much on there. But it's at the top of my page. It's pinned. I switch it out as things happen and new things come up. Check that out. Um, <clears throat> some current stories. I'm actually working on a couple. There's one I did last week. I did a blurb about it and I've been meaning to sit down and write it ever since. And I said, no matter what, I'll do that today. And I've said that two or three days and today that was it. But something else in town came up and I think it's important to cover these events. So I will say they are written down. I've got all my notes. They're ready to go. I will get them on there, but I want to make sure I have everything. So don't think I'm forgetting you. I got you. Um, past things, just in the past several weeks, we've had a beauty pageant. A womanless beauty pageant was hilarious. I loved seeing all the community out. I made a little TikTok of all the pictures, put some music to it. thought it was hilarious. People love it. I just loved seeing the community back out, and they've been out at so many things. And I know it's, it's fundraisers. The election's coming up. I try to put election coverage out there too. I don't do politics. I don't like getting involved, but I put those videos from Monroe Monday out there for y'all to see. Um, other things that are on Monroe Monday as well, information about the community, the 4-H stuff, everything that's going on, Randy and I cover it. Like this page, watch for it. Um, there was a middle school reality store. I'm checking my notes. Um, the Monroe... County Fire and Rescue Squad had a fundraiser. The Auntie Anne's pretzel truck was out. All of that. I go to it. I cover it. Um, I'm a full-time stay-at-home mom. I got three kids. I got two grandbabies. Sometimes I used to like to go to a lot of the sports and get the pictures. I just don't have the time anymore unless it's my own children. So please don't feel that I, I got volleyball and I ignored everybody else. When and if I have time, I get to those. But like I said, I'm a very busy person. I try to cook dinner every night. That's a struggle sometimes, but it's important to me to get this out there for y'all, and I really enjoy it. My family is a huge supporter. You know, they're perfectly fine most of the time. I've got to go do this. I've got to go do that. They're cool with it, and I love that I can take them with me to most of it. Um, I'm not sure if I'm forgetting anything. I got the, you know, I post the upcoming events, <clears throat> and then I go to the events, and I get the pictures and the stories. Sometimes I write a little blurb. Sometimes... I write a big, huge story. It just depends if it's self-explanatory. Send me your events. Send me anything you think I will go to. Some people are like, I don't know if you would come to this. But I will, unless, you know, something else comes up or I have actual work that I have to do. Um, we're currently doing the thing at the library where we read this book. And we're having a discussion. <clears throat> and last week is the last week and everybody's hating to see it end. And we're talking about doing another one or movie nights or any kind of thing like that. And I think that is awesome. The community loves it. Get everybody out. Get them doing things. Get them doing these free things. And your community, your row, my row, Monroe, that's where it comes from. There's just so much to do. Please don't think there's not. Keep up on my page. 
I'll keep you updated on everything. If I miss something, if I miss your event, it is not on purpose. Let me know. Also, sometimes there's two or three things at once, and I do my best to run around and go to everything. Sometimes I have to pick and choose. But I will be there. Keep liking the page. Keep sharing the page. Tell everybody about the page. I guess that's everything. I keep checking my list. Um, I really think that's everything. I've had to start over a couple times on this video because of you know, dogs and the crazy wind going on and everything. So I think I have everything. If not, check out the page. Like I said, just keep scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. You will not get bored. There is everything in the world on there. So y'all have a great day. And um, oh, this weekend... Um, there is the 4-H Expo. It's going on at the extension office during the day. Um, all the official times and dates and everything are on my page for this. Relay for Life is going on at the Wellness Center. And the basketball team, the girls, are having a fundamentals and an auction and a supper. I think that's everything. The Guatemala Mission Team has an online auction coming up. Um, oh, the tennis team is doing eggs like i think it's stuffed eggs they will do for you and deliver for you that's on my page everything's on my page go check it out y'all have a great day